bridge bigger. Here's the neck. Here's the middle. Where is it? There it is. That's pretty low and quiet. But we can't have that. We gotta turn it up. Here we go. I'm probably not gonna talk anymore. I'm just gonna rock. I do have a little bit to say. It's really neat because if you uh, if you play with your fingers like such, kind of soft to hard, just without even uh, tweaking anything volume-wise or on your guitar, just by the amount of attack you do, there's the amp's just so responsive. It's freaky cool. So here's fingers, here's pick. All right, back to playing. sensitive it is just touching each knob I mean it's like it's extreme the, the difference it makes all right <laughs> go any higher than that it might make me uh, sterile but it gets even brighter if you needed to up pretty much the whole time and I still am here it is you know volume rolled back rolled back even more rolled up mm, all the way
Yeah, I'm gonna have to do a bunch of demos of this thing. I mean, I hate to make big bold statements, you know, and say my stuff is better than yours or any of that kind of crap, because I don't believe in that. But, guess what? This is the greatest amplifier ever built. I'm not kidding, it really is. I mean, it is super tweakable with a very limited amount of noob lease. Yeah, there's even one back there. But, the Z-Rec totally kicks ass. So sensitive to your playing, your picking, even just touching the knobbies. You just look at them and there's just such a sensitive, tweakable, groovy, awesome EQ involved. Oh, okay, I'm gonna go take a shower. I'm gonna do more demos of this amp. I love it. I love it. I love it.